Yep, yep. Selena's number one hip hop station, Hot 107. Now your boy Reese locked in with you, and I got some Atlanta royalty Woo-hoo. in the building, both from Queens, Empresses. I don't even know what to call them right now. I'm, I'm just gonna call them Fly Diamond and Princess in the building. What's up, ladies? What's, What's up? Miss right? Hannah, ATL, <laughs> Crime Mob representatives in the building. Absolutely. Be home, be home. Home, yeah. home. <laughs> Talk to me, man, because I, I was telling a few people y'all was coming. They was like, they coming together for together, real? We here. Hey, y'all here. ATL, what's up, man? There it is. <laughs> I, I, that's going to be the first question. <laughs> that's Nine gonna be. Power. I can't say it because I don't want to get he tooled or me tooled what? or whatever. <laughs> But uh, and I seen which how y'all did how y'all did bro in the morning. So I'm. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Well, you know, we got an EP out now. It is called Vagina Power, and it's it's really about you know women sticking together. You know, we we coming back. We doing this thing mm-hmm. for the culture and everything, and we're just embracing this new movement with all of these women. It's like just it's beautiful, man. So you know, we got to come back for our master class. Come back for this bad bag that is in the rap game big now bag. that wasn't there before right. you know picking big up bag. all these extra big bags that are here <laughs> no now cap, no cap no cap <laughs> none whatsoever you're not familiar with these two ladies you probably haven't been on earth mm-hmm. but uh we talking <laughs> about the the queens of crime mob uh two of the most memorable verses ever hey. you know what i'm saying then uh we know everybody fell in love with y'all during that time and y'all are celebrating what this 15 years 15 right here 15 years man my goodness <laughs> my goodness it y'all awesome how That's many a, people can say that they've lasted in an industry for 15 years? They still be relevant mm-hmm. and wanted. Mm-hmm. And people just and want still young. And young and no vibrant. No grace. Right. Made some mistakes. And no grace. Real quick and we still young. Mm-hmm. Right. No y'all grandkids. still here. Look, not grandkids. Some people got grandkids <laughs> out here and they rap us. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Ain't nothing <laughs> wrong with that. But you know, that ain't you all situation. Not us. So, uh, man, I'm, I'm chopping it up with them about a few things. So the first thing, this EP, was it five songs? Mm-hmm. How did y'all get together on that? It was just like, it was a single, mm-hmm. and then Function. y'all just said, forget it, we're just going to go in. The yep. response was so crazy. We was just like, you know, we were vibing. We knew that, like, when we started to get back together and just different things that never left us, mm-hmm. like our chemistry, they got kind of got us excited, and then the people was reacting to it and was like, y'all, we want this, we want more. Right. You know, even with us collaborating with other female MCs. So mm-hmm. we was like, shoot, let's go ahead and give them three. Yeah. Then we had three, and then we <laughs> recorded a couple more, and we narrowed them down to two. Mm-hmm. And then we just, you know, narrowed it down to five. So, yeah. Right. So, yeah, I got it. Everybody liking it. It's weird because you have multiple responses of who likes what track. Oh, I yeah. got you. But I got we brought you. one Everybody today. had their favorites. Yeah. yeah. Right. We brought one today. We got clean one today. Brand. Okay. Clean. All, All right. the way clean. It's clean, clean. Okay, clean, clean. Clean, clean. Clean, right. clean. Clean, clean. clean, clean. clean, clean. Right. <laughs> clean, clean. That's pressure for me right there. I like it. That, that's all that was. I don't think y'all caught that. I see looked at me like clean, clean. Clean, <laughs> clean. Wink, wink. Not rapper clean. <laughs> clean, clean. Clean, clean. Right. Like, <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. So this this EP that came together. Y'all pushing it. People love y'all. I, I've been, everybody, a lot of people been wanting it. Mm-hmm. They been wanting y'all to yeah, jump been out been. here. Been, been. Like for real, for real, we've been. It wanting had to it. happen in the right time, and right. I think um, first off, we started very young, mm-hmm. and we didn't really understand the power that we had. Um, we didn't understand our influence at the time, right? So that's a big scary thing to not know how powerful you are at a young age, and then growing up in an industry where you're the youngest on the totem pole or the mm-hmm. lowest on the totem pole, that kind of psychologically affects a lot of things. And then on top of that, being in a group where it's Six different personalities, personalities and goals. ways of life and yeah. everything and and um just scheduling a lot of that at a young age takes a toll on anybody. Right. Um and I think now with uh, both of us being mothers mm-hmm. and yeah, um, raising, that. Y'all rehearsed that part. Huh? No, you can't that part. Right. Just come in. Mm-mm. Like I'm surprised we're not dressed like today. Right. You but can't yeah, teach certain things. You can't and right. you can't and that's when I up. it's a lot of things that let me know that things are bigger than us individually. Absolutely. Like right. the Juju on a Beat thing happened out of nowhere, and mm-hmm. I was like, okay, out of any other song that these two boys who were bored that day right. could have made any Blew other beat up. or Googled any other beat, and they, they did it to Nuck If You Book, and that went viral overnight. Right. That, and y'all got bags uh, off of that, right? Did yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was, got y'all yeah. That, was that was crazy. crazy. Like, Wow. Yeah, and even seeing the paperwork for that, it was like... You know I was saying? just finna say, but right. that was two different things because that was um, the bitch can't do it like me song right. that oh came out God, real was. quick. Right. It that was, was like in two a, years. A re- yeah. They remixed our record two twice. different groups. Right. Twice in one year, you're right, yeah. Yeah, right. and we got paid. Beyonce danced 
seven seconds of the Bet You Can't Do It Like Me record. And That's since a bad. she's since she played it for more than five then seconds. Then license and checks the started license coming. license checks. Man, so after five seconds, you got to get paid for it. So off of that one sample, On three Super different Bowl. groups got paid right. from the Super Bowl off of seven seconds. Now, listen, if you guys aren't familiar with what's going on, all my uh, <laughs> entrepreneurs and rappers Man. and business people coming up, get your paperwork get your right. paperwork. Because y'all got a bag off of that. Which is surprising because I know y'all had to go through some things to get y'all stuff back right. Yeah. How was that? Like, was y'all working together? And I know at the time, we're going to address the elephant in the room. At the time, y'all wasn't talking like mm-hmm. that, for real. Y'all wasn't being a family y'all should have been. Mm-hmm. But y'all jumped back. Yeah. How was it a trying to get out of business? A lot of times it's because 1079. Right? You know it. You know it. Birthday bash and whatnot. The birthday bash. Had to get, had to get the, the family back together. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we would do a lot of the birthday bashes and stuff. And whenever y'all come, whenever y'all call, you know, we come. Right. It was um, a whole nother respect. So it was like, yeah. we could have been not talking like that, but it was like, right. dang. It's like y'all our parents. You know we started saying? here. Yeah. So right. it's like whenever y'all call, we have to come. So whatever differences we have, mm-hmm. everything right. is put to the side for the culture. Right. It's it's yeah. certain people like that hot just we kind of like stuck with. You know yeah. what I'm saying? R.I.P. to Low cuz he yes. was one of those people. Mm-hmm. That's my guy. That's my dog, man. Um Low, man, I just felt bad just mm-hmm. having to bring that up, but that's my my man. But uh Low, I'm talking about y'all, Troy, mm-hmm. who else? Uh Franchise man. Boys, Franchise yeah. Boys, absolutely. Scrap and yeah. It's a couple more. Trillville. Trillville, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. It's a couple more. That, it's just like you got to have Atlanta core that. team. Yeah, that it's core like, team. It's something like we're like the super friends of something. Like, right. Like, y'all like, yeah. 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 y'all like the Avengers. Y'all like the Avengers of Seriously, Atlanta though. rap. Yeah, we, we really perform. hold Atlanta on our back for real. Yeah. Did we say Bone Crusher? Yeah, Yeah, bone, of course. Of course, Bone. Twins. Yeah. Yeah. And mm-hmm. we, yeah. we were the we youngest in that whole thing. Like, everybody was coming up, but... We were babies. still teenagers yeah. while everybody was making their own name. So for us to be that young and to, you know, at the time to be looked at as like the little kids right. of the crew. But we thought y'all was grown talking people. Talking that, because we were talking Because y'all talking that talk. Talking. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Y'all had grown women and feeling acting. like they could just beat up people. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and they, they went through with it, too. Some of yeah. them did, but, you yeah. know. But everybody can Y'all relate. made it. Y'all made it real hard for me to host clubs at that time. I just want y'all to know that. Put your back against You know the you crowd. was in the crowd, too. I mean, you know, put your hands in your fist like this and all that. You know what I'm saying? We had to do all it. All of that. <sighs> I remember the pics. Yeah. Yeah, for I remember sure. the tall tees. <laughs> all of that. I remember. <laughs> we kicking it right now with Diamond and Princess. What's up, ladies? And now, uh, man, we talking about all things that is them, the history yes. of y'all, man. What, what period do you think, like, because of y'all are bouncing back right now together mm-hmm. in the year of the woman. Because that's all I've been saying all the year. year of the, the year woman. of the woman. You got the stallion. Mm-hmm. You got city girls. Mm-hmm. You got everybody. Mm-hmm. Man, cash doll. Everybody. Cardi. We can't forget about it's Cardi. beautiful. What's everybody. so dope about us and it's a blessing It's like we're that glue. Yeah. yeah. You know, we are still, we kind of, mm, a lot of them are around our age, but a lot of them we are older than the female yeah. MCs. But we came up, like she said, and we were the babies. Mm-hmm. So we kind of connect that bridge from the generation that raised us right. to the up-and-coming generation. And right. I think that's mm-hmm. one of the key things that we keep in mind when we're out and we you know, we run into these other right. female MCs by showing them love and doing the things that were applied to us. Because, yeah. you know, we have to set the tone. So listen, these ladies right here, like I said, they kind of mm-hmm. like J. Cole had a song, he dropped Middle Child. And I feel like mm-hmm. that is y'all. Yeah. Yeah. It's like y'all the OGs to the new ones. Mm-hmm. But y'all ain't old now. Yeah. Y'all like we still young OGs. Young OGs. Well, old, though. No, I'm not saying, oh, I'm just saying y'all ain't. At whatever I, age we, that is, we, y'all ain't we that age. Are okay, okay. Veterans. In veterans. This game. Yeah. We started at 14 and 15. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And we are not 14 and 15. I just hate that people. <laughs> no I, this, this is the part I hate. What and I love. It's been in decade plus. Right. <laughs> this, is, this is what I love, though, because a lot of times we don't get a chance to cherish our people that kind of was in the game for a minute and have been in the game. Y'all are still being super relevant. Mm-hmm. And y'all been in this game 15 years, which is something that should be commended upon. And Nori says this on Drink Chance. Like, we got to get y'all roses while y'all here. Like, I remember watching y'all on, on videos and mm-hmm. all of that and be like, man, they popping. And to have y'all in the mm-hmm. studio now is just a beautiful thing. You know what I'm saying? To see y'all dropping new music. Y'all got this merch. Y'all got the new, a yeah. new like, feel of this game now. Yeah. Can you imagine, like, if... if it's funner. Yeah, if y'all had social media then, like, yeah, how, how, y'all would have no, known no, 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 how no. popping y'all were. 
if we would have had social media back then, Game it would have been a problem. Game over. Mm. Because you know what? I take it back. Y'all DMs were we, flooded. Warner Brothers gave One. us a phone. We was yeah. Heard. Remember that? Yep. The YouTube phone? Yep. When YouTube, we did a little bit. When we YouTube recorded. first, first dropped mm-hmm. and Warner was trying to figure out social media, they yeah. gave us a phone and whatever we recorded went straight, straight to, YouTube. to YouTube. Wow. So, <laughs> the b- <laughs> The stuff they was doing. The boys. So maybe it's. Timing is everything. Yeah. Right. We're ready now. Yeah. Because right <laughs> they was going live, live. Yeah. Live, live. Oh, back live. then. YouTube. And it was going straight to YouTube. Like, bro. It was supposed to be somebody that monitored the content. Oh, nobody was doing Before that. they uploaded it. But right. <laughs> they was pressing upload, <laughs> upload. And they, man, it Anything, was Anything, everything was up Daddy's there. daughters bent over on oh, YouTube. Oh, my God. <laughs> so, yeah, timing is everything. We timing glad. is everything. <laughs> yeah. Like timing. But, you know, I don't like, I don't like social media like that. I don't like opinions i don't like i like your social media though it's like, super balanced everything is about king I'm yeah like that's what i'm saying media. like your it's son like, is it's his page it's his page yeah yeah it's, it's, it's like it's page. really his page especially my stories like he woke up he ate today right he was breathing look at him sleep he ate again <laughs> right he's back sleep <laughs> they be like well, when the music coming bump you he sleep again <laughs> look at him he rolled over i don't know it's the first child syndrome Mm-hmm. Once I get my second child, I'm like, all right, King, mm-hmm. take your sister, go feed him. Oh, so yeah, uh, you can't do it like that. You, you gotta give the, her the, the same. <laughs> you gotta give her the same energy because she gonna go back and be like, wait a second, mom. And you know what? I said I wouldn't do that because I'm a middle child and mm-hmm. Jay is the firstborn, and I feel like my parents like got all of their goodness <laughs> and stuff on him. And then I came 16 months later, and it was like overwhelming. Like, oh, here's another one. What are we gonna do? So I don't want to do that to my child, but I think it's going to be, like, inevitable. I got you. And y'all's kids six months apart. Did y'all plan that? Technically, six, it's, it's, is six, it seven? Seven. December. We didn't plan it. We, April, don't, almost, we weren't even speaking like that. December, January. Y'all got so telepathy. Five? Yeah. Five months apart? That's that. April, yeah. yeah, y'all definitely can't get rid of each other. Man. Like, <laughs> this is my son it's, named Prince. Her son named King. King, King yep. Yeah. That's it's crazy. Some, it's some stuff that I just feel like is bigger than me. Bigger than her, bigger than us. Yeah. Um. So I just go with it. I'm I'm a very spiritual person. Um. I feel like everything happens for a reason, mm-hmm. and um. My steps are ordered. So I'm just ready. I'm ready to get these bags, get on these stages. You know right. what I'm saying? Shots Do these the, features. Yes. Shouts out to Asian Doll. Let's talk we to did about a dope that. collaboration yeah. and <clears throat> the vibe with her. Just like for her to just come. Yeah. And really salute us and just you know get a a real. You know, this industry is, is, is fake, right. you know. Right. But when you come across a lot of real ones, you know, you, you try to hold on to hold her. On she to was cool. Back. So she was real. We got a dope banger. We about to shoot mm-hmm. the videos for her project. Nice. And I'm excited. Like she said, all these female collaborations. Right. We just finna just female collab crazy. I feel this. like this. Female and male, I feel you like know everybody. I ain't saying they owe y'all a verse, but it should happen. Like I see everybody mm-hmm. in the game. I be like, y'all yeah, really need. Now. Okay. Problem. Who would you be? No, I wouldn't who would be surprised. you be excited to hear us with? Y'all, yeah, male or female? Everybody I named female, earlier. Like, like yeah. I want, I want to see y'all do. I would love to see y'all do like a ladies' night mm-hmm. with y'all, city girls, um, Meg, mm-hmm. Cardi. Yep, I, mm-hmm. I want that. I want that. I want that. I want Young and May on it. Drizzy, shout mm-hmm. out to and Drizzy. Drizzy. Yeah, yeah, I, like Drizzy. Yeah, I, I need that. Okay, so that's Gage one. Love too, and man. I, you know who I want to do? Gonna make it ten minutes long because so, you can't leave folks. Nah, out. and you know what? Because of who she is here, I remember Ladies Night. Angie Martinez. She she wasn't a rapper, but she was on a song. Yeah. I need Miss Shanique on a song. Oh, hey. yeah, because I, I, I need that. Can somebody can somebody get her real quick? Can you open the door? Open, just open the door. Hey, Shan. I need you for like one second. I need you for like I need you for like one second. Yeah. Cause I said I need she you on the song. Like left uh, I need the you one. on the song. She out here. She out here. She. I'm not important enough hey, for her to ever hey, come hey. in the studio before us. I talk. But we was just talking about. Hey, look, hey, hey, hey. we was just talking about like if they had a mega collaboration. I wanted them to do like a ladies' night with like Meg and City Girls and all that. But I was like Angie Martinez. She wasn't a rapper. For that time, but it was dope for her to be on the song. I said, I need Miss yeah, Shanique on the song. To support the record. But you do too, so I need you on the song. Oh, yeah, we'll be on all the radio. Hey. Wednesday. That's what I'm talking about. BDS. So, so listen, BDS. I just want my pop, right. 
I just want my pup daddy credit. That's all I want. You know what I'm saying? Push button. That's it. That's all I need. Take that. Take that. Daddy credit. Yeah. I want to spin around in the video. You know that's all I want. And inserting himself. That's all I want. As we ladies now, I can be holding the drinks. It don't matter what it is. I just want to be in there. Kill him with the shoulders. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You gotta. You gotta do a little. Ah, so, you know what I mean? I gotta go, because you always have it so damn hot in the studio. Bro, I turned I it down on what's going on. I, I really think it's y'all. All right, so that, that we got that in the works. That's all I wanted. All right, so so back to what oh, y'all yeah, got gonna, coming we up. We're going to get on Shanika verse then. We Collabs. Lie. Collabs. Yeah. I need to know about them, because I know y'all got everybody on y'all phone. You can't talk about it. You can't talk yeah. about it. It's some no, uh, some more coming soon. Okay. All right. Some more females. Some more females. Look, that's smart. I like that smart. Okay, let's just get uh -huh. All we want to say is shots out to the Queen B, Lil' Karen. That's all we're going to wow. say. Wow. That's all we're going to say. You don't have to say nothing that's else. That's all we're going to say. I'm just going to assume that they did a whole album together. That's all. I'm just how rumors get started. It's fine. I said it. Because we active, Lil' Baby. Oh, okay. yeah. We active, Mrs. I, I like all it. about it. I like it. I you like know, it. I need to do. Yeah. Right, see, y'all uh -huh. doing too much good stuff. You yeah, just I'm leave stuff out. All, over the place. all right, so listen, that's the collabs. <laughs> they got a record. They got an album, whole album coming out. Lil Kim. That's cool. <laughs> I just made that up. So look, oh, so we gonna get back to a little. <laughs> <laughs> we are gonna get with, with y'all's publicists. Anything's possible. You know what I'm saying? The sisters over there. So listen, this is what we gonna do with this though. The next thing we got to talk about the merch. These dolls. Yes. All right, how did that come about? Okay, so we did the Solange thing. Mm -hmm. Um. Shouts out to my baby father, Keith. He reached out to someone who started the process on um, getting the dolls. Nice. Uh, but we didn't work out with her. Mm -hmm. We had to move on right. to somebody else. But that's dope to just have Solange in your contacts and just be able to hit her. Well, yeah, Solange hit us up. Big you know what I'm saying? Big right. sister Solange. You know what I'm saying? Really? She was on the album, all right? Together yeah, we're on her album. Yeah. Crazy. Crazy, yeah. right? And she picked a clip. That was like 12 years old of us playing around, wow. trying to get in Onyx. And we were too young to get in Onyx. <laughs> <laughs> so it was, One time we, Onyx. We, we had our money and everything. Man, right. I know we was in did. the stretch limo thinking we was doing it, club hopping. Was and we it at the awards here? Mm -mm. It was a random party? It was I really a one random time. night. No, this one was. wanted to go out and shoot content. Right. I, I remember like, one time. I think. Remember? We was, it we was, was Germany. We missed the uh -uh. awards. Here we go. Industry <laughs> secrets. Being told. That's what that's what this that, this is what the uh Remember? the clickbait gonna be industry secrets. <laughs> you know, some stuff we just gotta keep between us. But right, I got you. she remembers the day now. Yeah, I right. And we we club hopped for like <laughs> everybody wants to know now. They're not gonna tell y'all. <laughs> Remember that day in band camp? <laughs> no, but uh we we club hopped for like a couple of hours. Right. And Onyx was the last stop. And um we was waiting on somebody to pull up so they can get us in the club. Was playing around and um, yeah, she took that clip and put it on her album. Right. How did she get it though? Watching YouTube. YouTube. Right. Like, and she this was when y'all had the YouTube yeah, it phone wasn't even for back like, then. Um, it that's was crazy. crazy. No, she she saw it this year, right? Yeah, because wow. she had reached out to us and we were supposed to like fly out to her or whatever. Yeah. And just like this is when she was still in the process of recording and just yeah. vibe with her, get some vibes. Right. And then she was supposed to come here, but then our our um schedules yeah, were all yeah. conflicting or whatever. Then the next big thing was Coachella. Yeah, yeah. Was after Coachella. she put it together, we yeah. were like, oh, you know, we loved that the album was out. I was gonna be bougie. That was, that was on my bucket oh, list. To, okay, yeah. Coachella is definitely nothing after Coachella. Y'all need, y'all deserve Coachella. Y'all yeah. do. Maybe that would have been year. that year, yeah. next year. But because uh, her band members, all of them had got sick, so mm. it wasn't enough time for her, from my understanding. Put to it get, together. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. And that then that's when the Met Gala came. Yeah, and then we did the Met Gala. And that's that was crazy. How was that for y'all? It was dope. It was intimate. You know, at first I was thinking it's going to be like everybody in the world here. And VIP then we got there. Baby. Yeah, yeah, we got So how does that, like, so so VIP. some people don't understand y'all, like the maturation of who y'all have become over the years. Like you started out doing house party fight music. That's mm -hmm. just the way to and put it. And it wasn't like, acceptable. Like, no, it wasn't. To be able to walk into the Met Gala, be accepted. People know who y'all are. Y'all performing with a huge artist. Y'all a huge artist on y'all. How did y'all feel? Did y'all feel like y'all just want to say forget some people or what? Like, nah, tell me. Look, it walking so in, surreal. I thought I was getting punked. Oh, you thought somebody was going to be like, psych! Man, <laughs> yeah. it was surreal. The way my anxiety be set up sometimes, I be like, all right. Everything is not moving from plan A to plan B. Yeah. On the time that it's supposed to, something is wrong. Mm. Abort mission. And it was like, okay, wait a minute. The flights aren't secured. We got to leave in like an hour and they didn't right. buy the flights. So I was like, oh, shit, what are we going to do? And then everything just started lining, lining up. up. And then we got there and oh, it wasn't Chinatown. Where were we? It was somewhere in New York, yeah. but 
we it was very intimate. Like yeah, we it was, was really, really intimate. Just her personal people. Yeah. So. And only like she, her celebrity friends. Yeah. But so. it was like we was all like in a tight knit area for a yeah. long period of time. So we really got a chance to just not just over the phone through emails. Like yeah. really get and kick it and vibe. Kick it, kick yeah. it like yeah. that's big sis. That's what's up. So we was yeah, really partying. The sun came up. Shout out to Princess of Diamond at the Met. At the Met. Yalla, crazy. Shouts out, shouts out to oh, Solange as well. Right. And her whole, yeah. her whole staff. Who, how, who had the outfits? How them come about? Shouts Ooh, out Fiscani. to Fiscani. Okay. Fiscani, um, the Ivy showroom. Mm. Shouts out to her. She been doing it, I think, 20 plus years. She yeah. used to style TLC. I think she still does do some mm. styling for them. Yeah. Jagged Edge and uh, a lot of other Had y'all fly, as well. fly. Yeah, and she's here. The showroom is here in Atlanta. Yeah. In Dope. Miami Circle, mm-hmm. Ivy Showroom. Right. So yeah, she um everything was last minute. I think we got the call what Saturday, mm-hmm. and by Saturday everything was closed. The mall, well, the boutiques and stuff, everything was shutting down. So right. we literally had, she had to open up her showroom Sunday. Yeah. To dress us, right. and then we flew out that Monday. That's super dope. All right, so look, we gonna we gonna we gonna speed up because I see this clock music, ticking. New music. <laughs> new music. Can we leave Tell that me one about it. Single? Yes. Shouts out to K Major. K hey, Major. She was like the first producer that we worked with for this whole vagina power before we even knew it was going to be so big and be vagina power. Oh, right. And, and I really can't believe that we connect all the female entities time. together, like how we doing. Right. Inspiring the generations to come. Like he really took his time with us, and we got a lot of bangers with him. But this one in particular, for mm. some reason, especially with his vocals on there, we yeah. was like, no, we want you to do more. Like this mm. is the one that the people love, and it's That's called dope. Light of the Funk. Light up the fun. All right. Yeah. So then y'all go on to introduce the song. What's up, this princess? What's happening? It's your girl, Diamond. And this is our new single, Light, Light up, up the Function. Right, uh, right here Light first. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Can't wait for these videos to drop, too. Okay. Hey, right, listen, man, I appreciate y'all coming by, for real. Thank uh, you. Anytime next thing drop, I need y'all back. Hey. All right. Mm-hmm. Hit us up on all of our social media platforms. Right. Um, Princess Digital for everything social media. Princess Empire for a website. Um, Dominate TL for Instagram and Twitter. Official yeah. Dominate TL for Facebook. Yeah. You spell get, it different. Get D Y A. Yep. No, uh uh-uh. D I A. D I A. Look at you trying to mess up the function. I want to make sure nobody mess it up. Now, um, and then look out, we're going to do a special Atlanta release for the dolls. Um, so Atlanta patrons can get it first, physically. Um, and the album release, album release party here in Atlanta. In Atlanta first, we're going to do them here. And um, the Vagina Power and the Diamond and Princess merch. The hoodies, you know, it's going to get cold outside. The hoodies and um, the, the trays, the, tray, the, the trays. rolling trays, the shot right. glasses. Roll on me. Roll on me. You got shout out to right. uh, Jeff B in <laughs> Utopia. There you go. Shouts out to Sh- Shante and Mimi from Eyelash Vision. All right. this together for us. And make sure y'all follow them to uh, get updates on the Atlanta album release party for Vagina Power. Europe. They got everybody female and popping. Thank you Love for them. having us. Yes, Come on, sir. man. It's my pleasure having y'all up here. I've been knowing you for a minute. It's my yeah, first time man. really meeting Diamond, so that's what's I up. I listen to you, but now I can put a face with a voice. Yeah, yeah I always is. listen to you. All right, cool. I appreciate it. What What you thought I looked like? This is something I'll be asking. <laughs> No, nah, for real, because this one lady was like, I thought she was like big and like dark skin. And I was really? like, you don't, you don't sound big. You okay. Don't sound big. Oh, you, 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 you handsome. Thank you. Don't have me in here blushing. Cool voice. This, this time another day. Right, you know, it and works. I listen to your choice of of song selection. Yeah. Okay. She really listens. I'll take it. <laughs> I'm gonna go home and be like, Diamond, know me, bro. I just want y'all to know that. All right. Silly. Appreciate y'all. Love y'all, man. Keep this Love thing coming. You. Keep doing it for the ladies. Cause I got three little girls, so you know what I'm saying. Uh-huh. Better see y'all popping out here. I love it. Amen. Amen.